say bananas, you say peppers. And I feel like it has been, once again, a millennium since I've been on this channel. Where have I been? Unfortunately, puking a lot, but uh, I am back. You know what? I need a sippy sippy break. I was just trying to like take a thumbnail, which I don't know why I'm so winded from that. <sighs> I'm still on the mend. I'm still getting better. Sippy sippy. I feel like sometimes I should start like every one of my videos, every one of my vlogs with like a bit of meditation, like a little bit of yoga. Ooh, I tried to do yoga when I was like in eighth grade and I like just didn't even have the focus for it then. Like, have you tried to do yoga? Yoga? <laughs> have you tried to do yoga? You know what? It's gotta be these glasses. They're making me extra silly. Have you tried to do yoga? Is it something that can be mastered? Because I swear the minute that I sit down and try and think of nothing, that's the minute that my brain is gonna be like snakes. I'm just incapable of thinking of nothing. Anyway, what I was trying to say is, uh, today we're gonna be unboxing some of my all-time favorite figurines, and I feel like they don't make nearly as many of them as I wish that they did. Anyway, you guys, if y'all have been here for any amount of time, you probably remember these little fellas. They are called Sunny Angels, and we unboxed them on Graveyard Girl, we've unboxed them here, I have been doing them for years, and I love them. They just came out with a new series, which, oh my gosh, these might be some of my favorite designs ever besides, of course, the yearly Halloween Sunny Angel collections, but this is called the Sunny Angel Circus Series. So many cute things, and the good thing is that I feel like we have maybe more Ver variations? Variety? Variety? Variations? Variants? What am I trying to say? Somebody help me. Um, I think we have more options this time. It looks like there are six kinds. Now that I'm saying that out loud, six kinds plus secrets? Ooh, secrets! multiple. Uh, but now that I'm saying that out loud, that does sound kind of familiar. But let me tell you, everybody, send me some good luck today because the one thing that I have always wanted to add to my Sunny Angel collection is like Sunny Angel's sidekick. And I think he's this little like mouse deer looking thing. And I think his name is like Robbie, Roddy, Randolph, Rudolph, something like that. Uh, but we've got tons of cute options and I don't even know why I just keep talking when I should be walking. I went to uh, Austin for my birthday, as I do every single year on my birthday. It's like the thing that I love to do most on my birthday is to just go to Austin, go to my favorite places, eat my favorite food, shop in my favorite shops. So they had these on my birthday uh, when we went to Toy Joy and I was very excited. They didn't have a whole case, but I mean, it's not like you need a whole case. How many did I buy? We will just uh, unbox these until I don't have anything else to open. Suddenly I can't count to seven. That is amazing. Ooh, this one was like glued to the top of the box. Does that mean something? I always love the little um, wrapper as well, because it's like, it says sunny angel all over. It's got little angels. Um, ooh! Is that what you're called? The uh, ring master. What's the difference between a ring master and a ring leader? I love their little faces. I love Cupid dolls. Do you know what? I just love dolls. I love all dolls. Like, I've been on a kick for the past couple of days to look at custom Blythe dolls. I have always wanted a Blythe doll and I never even knew what they were until somebody in the Swamp Fam and I always wonder, I always wonder if like these memories that I have of like particular Swamp Family members, I always wonder like are they still subscribed? Are they still watching? But I remember somebody made like a bunny Blythe doll and it 
blew my mind. Like a sassy bun. Um, I think that there was even like, cause they have little props. Um, so I think that they had a, like a little sippy sippy cup. And I think I was wearing camo and blue eyes and they could make the doll blink. And I was just like, Oh my God. And like, I kind of didn't know what it was, or I feel like I had seen Blythe dolls before, but I just like, didn't know the name of them. You know, I'm taking forever. You guys. Ooh. Ooh. Wow. Oh, what are you? Now it's like, I want to get into Blythe dolls, but I wish I could talk to like some sort of Blythe expert because there seems to be so many different makes and models and ways that you can even like customize them yourself. And I am very fascinated, but, uh, I also know nothing. So there's that. Yeah. But I'm just obsessed with dolls. This one is the circus tent. Of course. Ooh, wouldn't it be great if we just got like a whole set and like no repeats? Ooh. I don't know. And then you guys know, of course, I'm into all my old creepy dolls. Um, I don't mean to call you creepy to your face. I'm into reborn dolls. Um, and is there any other kind of doll that I like? Koopy dolls? I don't know. It, which is so weird because I know I've said this a million times. Why do I always repeat myself? But it's so weird because I literally hated dolls when I was a kid. Never wanted a doll, never liked dolls, never cared about dolls, didn't want a doll of any kind. Only liked action figures and gross toys. I don't know. I don't know why. So I'm just like making up for it. Um, boom! Ooh! Okay, come on. One of you has to be a Rodney. A uh, Roddy. Oh, I saw like an animal head and I got, oh, but this one is so cute. He's like a little party bear. It says party on his shirt. An adorable little bear hat. What are these like pajama things called? Kirigumi? That's not probably the word for it at all. So I shouldn't even try because I'm probably saying something that I don't mean to be saying. So uh, this one's name is just bear. Um, so far so good. No repeats. Also, I need to redo my gel nails. Um, I feel like once one nail chips, it's just, it's all downhill from there. Uh, then you gotta redo them. Oh, they just look crusty and dusty. Oh my gosh. Let's see who we're gonna get in box number four. I keep trying to like jettison one out. <laughs> it's not working. Get out of the box. Ooh. Watch this one be Rodney and I just dumped him out on his little head. It's, oh no. We got our first repeat. We got another ringmaster. I hope we get the clown. That is kind of the other one that I was hoping for the most besides Rupert. Um, I've just never seen a Rupert in real life. Wait, what have I done to this camera? All of a sudden there's like this weird display. Like what, what's going on? Oh my gosh. Box number five. Yes. Also a sippy break, please. Because today is my first day back drinking a uh, sweet tea after I've been sick and it's been delightful, refreshing. <sighs> what is Bunny without her tea? What is, I don't even want to get my hopes up. You guys, I think this, oh yay. Oh my gosh. Okay. My hopes were up for all the other right reasons. We got a clown. He is so, so cute. I'm almost willing to say that this is my favorite Sunny Angel we have ever gotten. I don't know why I like this. I honestly don't like clowns. I really don't. I don't know what this whole, <laughs> yet, for the past couple of years, I feel like I've been on a whole clown kick. Mm, selective clowns. Only, only certain type of clowns. Only certain clowns though. Like I feel like if you gave me like, um, you know, like those like velvet, like a velvet canvas. You guys know like velvet paintings and stuff. Like those, if it was like a clown, one of those, no thank you. But something like this, so cute. I think it's cause I started liking the Joker on a whole. Um, and so then I'm like, oh, clowns. Aesthetic goals. Um, oh my God. Okay. I think what I was trying to say is, 
Um, I think the little sidekick, the little secret guy, he has to be so rare because if you think about it, how many years have I been opening these things up and I've never seen one? I have never ever seen one. Oh no, we got another repeat. Gosh dang it. You're cute, but you're not the one I was looking for. We still are missing an elephant and a lion and then the two secret kinds. But, uh, you know, it was so weird because a couple of years ago, I remember one of the Sunny Angel Halloween collections. It was like there was only supposed to be one secret type but we kept getting all these like weird color variants like we would get the ones shown on the box but it would be like purple orange green like yet they would only show one kind of i don't know that was a that was a very confusing year i think that was like the ones in 2016 or something i don't know it's been that was like when i was at my old old filming room so a very long time ago last one and it's a good dang thing because camera overheating all right this this is your last chance to not be a repeat <gasps> oh my oh my gosh this is so cute so for all of our repeats we did get quite lucky at the end um he's not rodney but he is uh the secret kind which is so awesome because they didn't even show um, like a preview of what shape he would be or anything on the box. And that is so adorable. And also it's a bunny. So now I really love this one. And I feel like it's a cute like little flip between this one because it's like the same hat. So it almost looks like he's doing a magic trick. These are freaking adorable. Even though we did get two repeats out of seven, I would kind of be inclined to buy some more of these and try and like complete the set. These are so, I, I've said it six times in this video, I do think that these are my favorite Sunny Angels that we've ever gotten. Toy Joy must have done this because this is so sweet. These are like um, little sticker packs. That is so freaking adorable. But they must be like a promotional thing because they say like not for sale on the back. So that's so sweet. They must have just like stuck these in here. I'm so excited. It's like all of the different little characters. Anyway, now I'm rambling. I say now I'm rambling as if the first 15 minutes and 51 seconds of this video was not rambling. But anyway, thank you guys so, so much for hanging out today and for watching. If you're not subscribed already and you would like to be a member of the Banana Pepper Squad, hit subscribe today. You too can either be a banana, a pepper, or a banana pepper. Take your pick. Also, you can hit the notification bell to be notified every time I upload a new video to this channel. I love you guys so, so much, and I will see y'all again very, very soon. 